Now, your Central Coast forecast from KSBW Weather. This is Phil Freeman for Gina DeVecchio, and this is the view in Monterey. We have clouds. We also have some sun starting to poke through. The temperature at the Monterey Regional Airport is 61 degrees. That's pretty mild. And the dew point is at 56 degrees. They did report fog earlier, but it should be clearing out pretty rapidly. As we take a look at temperatures around the area, you can see really mild. 54 to 66, no 40s on this map. And you can see we have quite a bit of low clouds and fog off the coast. And we also have it into the Salinas Valley. And these clouds up here, these are storm clouds, which are affecting the far northern part of California. Temperatures around the state also very mild. The coldest is 43 at Lake Tahoe, but you take that out of the mix and it's almost entirely in the 60s till you get to Palm Springs at 81. Eureka, very mild at 61. That's their normal high temperature for this time of the year. And later today, Eureka is going to expect it to get to 73 degrees. That's because they have a storm which will be causing rain and mixing out the marine layer. And so they could have record rainfall as well as record heat today in Eureka all at the same time. Temperatures in the Central Valley, pretty normal for this time of the year. 80s around Sacramento and then 90s elsewhere, up to 109 in La Palm Springs and 110 in Las Vegas. And temperatures, or actually the situation out over the Pacific over the last 12 hours, we've been watching this cold front move toward the Pacific Northwest and extreme Northern California, and it is causing rain currently up at Crescent City, and it's expected to continue to bring rain much of today in that area, but not affect us except maybe help to give us slightly cooler temperatures. This is our future cast for the next several days, and you see this cold pool of air that's been affecting our weather. Well, it's going to move out of the way so that by Wednesday and Thursday, we'll be under the influence of much warmer air moving in from the deserts, and that's that's going to cause our temperatures to rise, especially in the inland areas. And then after Thursday and Friday, it's going to start to cool off a little bit. So temperatures today, though, will be a little bit cooler than what they were yesterday. Still very pleasant. 69 in San Francisco, the expected high up to 78 San Jose, 65 in Half Moon Bay, 70s and 80s in the Santa Cruz County area. And all these are a little bit cooler than what they were yesterday. 67 in Moss Landing, going up to 86 in Morgan Hill, 84 in Gilroy. And here in the Salinas Valley, we're going to be a bit cooler at 73 here in Salinas, up to 84 in King City. Also a bit cooler, but still very pleasant in the Monterey Bay area. Temperatures in the 60s to mid-70s in Carmel Valley. And then for the next eight days, we're going to see those temperatures cool off a little more tomorrow before rebounding Wednesday and Thursday. And in the inland areas, getting close to 100 Wednesday and especially Thursday and Friday. And not at all unusual for June. We are in summertime for all practical purposes. Not a bad day to hang outside on the coast, looks like. No, you still want to bring a jacket because if you, you're there to, uh, till dark, it can cool off very quickly. Sure, sure. I know I've experienced that before. <laughs> yeah, a lot of people have. <laughs> all right, Phil, thank you. Sure.